Hi everyone, uh, my name is Lauren Schelke. I'm a recruiter here at the Catapult Network. Uh, gonna be making a video here chatting with you about some tips and tricks how to transition into video interviews from home. First things first, I'm gonna start off by getting into something a little bit more professional. It's important to dress professionally for all your interviews, including virtual interviews. And even if you think a workplace might be a little bit more casual, dress to impress. Dress as if you're going to meet that CEO. And I definitely feel that it can be tempting to be a little bit more casual on the bottom when you're doing a virtual interview and a little bit more professional on the top, but we encourage professionality from head to toe. You definitely want to make sure that you are feeling confident, you're feeling ready to go, and you never know if you're going to have to stand up in the middle of the interview and what might happen there. Next, I'm going to grab my laptop, I'm going to grab my table, and I'm going to get my station set up. Another thing to think about in your virtual interview is distractions and noise. Uh, noise can definitely come from pets, kids, and even roommates. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Try to minimize this. Try to find a way to get those kids occupied, put a pet in another room, and notify your roommates so they know that you are about to do an interview. And before I get started, something is definitely missing from my computer right now, and that is my power cord. Uh, you want to make sure that your computer is plugged in and ready to go and even charging during the interview. That way it's not going to die mid-interview. Uh, there are definitely programs, softwares that can cause the computer to die a little bit quicker than you would expect. This is also the time to check your video camera and check your microphone. You definitely don't want an awkward start to your interview. Hello? Can you see me? Is my camera on? Oh, is that good? There are definitely other distractions that you can try to avoid as well. Uh, number one being your phone. It's important to turn notifications off, turn sounds off, make sure that there's gonna be nothing there that's gonna be distracting to you. Sorry. And if you don't have access to a laptop, that's totally okay. You can absolutely use your phone during these interviews. There are apps you can download and a lot of programs that'll be able to let you do that. One thing we do encourage is finding a way to prop your phone up during that interview so you don't have to hold it the entire time. Uh, we do not expect a 45 minute workout with you. Um, yeah, so I, I chose UMD uh, for a lot of reasons. It was a, it was a great school. Um, I definitely, I loved the theater program. Uh, it was a great opportunity for me. And, Oh, sorry. Um, uh, yeah, and I, I think I gained a lot of skills from that school. Uh, really, it was a great experience for sure. <laughs> oh, God. And some final tips. You can absolutely have your resume at the ready during that interview. Uh, you can have that printed off, paper copy, so you can reference that to see your past work experience. You can absolutely take notes as well. Uh, we encourage a pen and a paper just so that you're not typing using that computer that you're also using as a camera. If something does go wrong, that's okay. Uh, we're kind of all in this transition together. I definitely have had interviews where my dog has started barking or I've had a roommate knock on my door. Address this issue if this happens. Talk to your interviewer about it. Um, no need to apologize or anything like that, but don't pretend it's not happening. Like I said, we're all going through it. I'm sure we definitely understand where you're coming from. Again, thanks for listening, everybody. I hope you enjoyed our video. Uh, feel free to leave a comment, ask any questions that you got about interviewing during this time. I appreciate your time with us. But again, I'm Lauren Schelke. I'm a recruiter here at Catapult Network. And we are really just trying to find uh, ways to help our recent graduates find their way into some entry-level positions. So we're a specialized recruiting company for those recent grads in that zero to two years of experience. So if you're interested in working with us, feel free to reach out. Uh, check out our Facebook, our Instagram, um, our YouTube channel, which is brand new here. Uh, we're going to try to be posting some more videos as we go along. So keep an eye out for those soon. They'll hopefully be coming your way. But thanks again, and I hope you stay safe, I hope you stay healthy, and I wish you the best of luck on all of your interviews in the future.